Hello, my name is Ian, and this is a review of Hard Ops, the add-on for Blender. As you can see here, it is $20, and I'd just like to start out real quick by telling you what I thought it was before I bought it. So I thought, as a total noob, you could pick up Hard Ops and suddenly become a hard surface modeling pro. And I'm looking here at these images, and these are just really gorgeous. But what you need to understand is, these have been created by people who have been doing hard surface modeling for a long time, and then used hard ops. In saying that, I don't want to scare you away if you are a beginner, but I don't think this is for you if you're just starting. So if I had to describe it, I would describe hard ops as hard surface modeling operations collected and simplified into easy access menus that are designed to save time. So I'm going to go through some pros and cons of hard ops real quick here. First of all, usability is really nice. The menus, like I mentioned, are really easy to access and I think they're optimized pretty well towards the functions that you would want to use. Another pro is it simplifies operations that would normally take like three or four clicks in different areas into just one click, one button, that does the whole, the whole lot of operations all at once, which is really great and clever. I think there's a lot of instances in this add-on where that happens and where it saves you lots of time, which is really great. Another pro is there's really great documentation, as you can see here. Look at all these it shows all the features and all the hotkeys, which is really nice. It's not all completely up to date in 2.8, but it will get the job done. You can learn really nicely what it does from there. So I'm going to hop over to cons really quick here. There's a learning curve, and it really does take you a lot of time to learn what tools are at your disposal in this add-on and what cases you would want to use them. And the last con is I found that it doesn't always play nice with box cutter, so sometimes mixing the two can precipitate a crash. Yeah. <laughs> One more thing that's kind of a pro and kind of a con at the same time is that it's in active development. And so there's new features frequently, and that kind of makes it unstable. Save often. So if you're into hard surface, yes, I really do recommend this add-on. It'll save you a lot of time and brain power that you can use in different areas that are more important and actually need your time. So yeah, that's what I think about hard ops. If you want to tell me what you think about, you can tell me in the comments. And if you enjoyed this, I'd appreciate it if you subscribed. I'm thinking of doing some hard ops tutorials in the future, and if that's something you would find valuable, do tell me. I would greatly appreciate that. So until then, cheers!